Hello ladies and gentlemen, today topic is all about 5 safety tips for digital payment online. So before starting the topic, please subscribe to my channel. Also press on the bell button to get notification about the new videos. So let's start the topic. As a consumer, most of us prefer the use of digital car based online payment system for our retail purchase because of our convenience and security they offer. Nowadays, most of the people are using debit card, credit card, doing shopping online because pe people are going to Amazon online and they are doing shopping. But there are a lot of hackers and attackers out there and they are robbing us. So we will be very careful about that and will have to protect ourselves be be because people who are doing the shopping visiting the shop before but now people are doing most of their shopping online at amazon at walmart they just sit at home and order all of their product online pay by credit card debit card and then their product are supplied to their home but there are hackers out there so there are five tips which must be followed to protect yourself from these kind of hackers and the number one is compliance. Different rules and regulations apply to the law firm operating under different jurisdiction. With the respect of payment, it is usually mandatory to comply with the payment card industry data security standards, which is PCI DSS. A third party services may be engaged to verify your PCI compliance. To ensure the PCI compliance procedure need to be established to protect files with sensitive information. In Europe, it is necessary to ensure that your payment service provider meet the GDPR requirement as stated in the So, this is the first one. The second is online system safety. When creating an online integrated system that accept payment on behalf of your firm or that you are doing any shopping, you need to ensure that the system is hosted on a secure environment, small businesses may often tend to overlook the security aspect thinking that they won't be targeted, but, but PT hackers are most likely to target them for the same reason. Ensure that the hosting provider for the system has the correct practices and safeguard in, in a place. Also ensure that the site is protected by secure socket layer SSL to encrypt any data exchange between the system and the external parties. Number third is human factors. Uh, in order to fully incorporate the digital payment, the cu uh, culture in your firm or organization, it is necessary to educate the all employees, especially those responsible for handling payment regarding the safety with measure required simple steps like password protected devices, secure and updated uh, software use of the VPN securing USB and other storage in workplace uh, in a long way in protecting customer data. Number four is two-factor authentication. Two-factor authentication uh, is the recommended best practice to be used by both parties when making payment. This protects against data loss fraudulent transaction caused due to the identity theft. Customer need to secure their data online and mobile transaction uh, using two-factor authentication. Online system accepting the payment need to ensure the data required for two-factor authentication is captured and verified for every new customer. And the form of mobile phone number, email ID, or biometric information depending on the mode of payment. The last one, number pip the customer data protection. With respect to payment, there is no real need to store the customer account for information or credit card detail for long term. The best way to protect the customer data is not to store it. In case where it is not required in situation where it needs to be stored, it should be encrypted and stored on a private network system with limited access for authorized person. A trusted third party payment partner may be engaged to ensure the collection and transfer of payment as well as uh, storage of the required payment data. So these are the five steps which must be followed to 
keep yourself protected from hackers attackers and it is a very hard earned money and these hackers can get it uh, easy way from you so it's all for today and take care bye